A Ferris wheel is a great example of regular motion. Take a look at how the Ferris wheel follows a pattern. It goes around and around. A swing set swing will always go back and forth. That's because these objects follow a pattern of motion. The motion that they put out is predictable. Take a look at this roller coaster. It always goes around and around in a pattern. Take a look at this roller coaster. Because they're falling down a hill, they're going to go forward. In your science notebooks, title it Patterns in Motion Experiment. For this experiment, we're gonna need a few materials. A foam tube, a roll of tape, a marble, and a meter stick. We'll also need two classroom chairs. In your second box, go ahead and write your prediction. What do you think is going to happen as a result of this experiment? First, we're going to need our foam tube and our roll of tape. Either ends of the foam tube are attached to both ends of the chair with a piece of tape and the dip in the middle is flat to the floor. Make sure that your foam tube is secured to those chairs so it doesn't fall. Now you're going to take your marble and your meter stick. Make sure the lower numbers are at the bottom of your meter stick. Put your meter stick flat to the ground. Take your marble and measure how high you are gonna drop the marble into the foam tube. I dropped my marble at 27 inches. Take a look at the effects of the marble when we drop it. The marble is following the pattern of the tube. The marble is following a motion back and forth. When we drop it at the top of one end of the tube, it follows the pattern of the tube. It goes down the tube and starts to climb back up on the other side. Can the marble's speed change? How can we make the marble go faster down the foam tube? This time, I'm dropping the marble at 32 inches. Let's take a look and see if it went any faster. What did you notice about the speed of the marble? Now it's time to fill out our four square. Was your prediction correct or incorrect? Don't forget to add details. Now, draw a picture of the experiment. Don't forget to add labels. Very similar to a roller coaster, our marble went in a pattern. So the next time that you're at a park, hop on that swing and notice the pattern of motion that you're following.